Hi everyone, Eileen Smith here, and we're over on YouTube because I just wanted to tell you about what a fantastic tool YouTube is for growing your business or your blog. Currently, you'll notice I have over 1,500 subscribers and over 132,000 views on my YouTube channel. I recently put together a YouTube rankings assault kit where I show you my five top weapons that I used to gain so many subscribers and I'll show you how I gained a loyal fan base on YouTube and you can get that report just by going to basicblogtips.com slash get YouTube report. Okay, now I want to show you how to track your statistics on YouTube with a brand new app that's available in the Chrome store called Syfe. Now, before we take a look at Syfe, I just wanted to go over into YouTube analytics and show you some of the problems that we have when we're trying to determine the performance of our videos. Well, now from YouTube analytics, YouTube gives us a snapshot of where we are with our top 10 videos in the last 30 days. But what if you want to track the performance of a specific video? You need to go up to the top and look for the video that you want. So if you want to track the performance of a specific video and it's not in your top 10, this process can get a little clunky and a little cumbersome. You have to search for it by title. Well, this one happens to start off with the words Google, but I have tons of videos that start off with the word Google. So I'm glad that I have Syfe now. So now let's go and check it out. Okay. I have already set up my Syfe account and I'm rocking the free version right now. Of course, they have paid versions, but what happens is for free, you get five widgets. So I'm going to show you how to add a widget. Now, currently I have a widget that's showing me YouTube. And once again, it's giving me those top 10 videos, but it's also showing me the performance, whether it's been going up or going down in the last 30 days. I'm also able to add a widget to look at the view duration, which we know is really important in our rankings. And you can resize these widgets. So let me show you how to add another widget right up here. Is where you add widgets and this is this app Syfe is great for monitoring more than one thing I'm just showing YouTube today but there are tons of apps that you can monitor with Syfe all your social media your blogging and so forth so let's just stick to YouTube for today so let's add another YouTube widget. When you do that, it allows you to configure the widget. You add in your account. Of course, allow the access. Now I can say there's a specific video and this is nice because your videos are listed alphabetically. So this video is the one that I want to monitor. It's a Google plus tip. It's a brand new video that I put out. I also emailed this to folks on my mailing list. I've been promoting it and I want to keep track on how it's doing. So I see it's not bad at all. Yeah. I've got a bunch of comments there. 135 views isn't bad. It's been a little over a week since the video was released. 
I've picked up some subscribers. I've got lots of likes. And that's wonderful. And I like how you can just glance at all these things at one time. So if you resize this, you get to see your average view duration across your channel. You get your top 10 videos. And you're also monitoring that one video that you wanted to keep track of. And you can change the name of this widget so that you'll remember which video it is. So I'm just going to change it to Google Plus. So I remember which video that is. Now let's add another widget. Once again, add my account in. And this time let's monitor something different. We can monitor the traffic sources or the playback locations. Or let's do a country map. And we're going to do that across all videos. So you get an idea here that, of course, U.S., Canada, India. If I wanted to just show that as a list, I could do that as, as well to see what the top countries are listed in order. Uh, there's a little glitch here. I believe this one was probably going to be United Kingdom. But I don't think that's a big deal. It's also showing me that, you know, my views have gone up in these countries. Now, this is something that you probably can't see at a glance over in YouTube Analytics. So anyway, guys, that's a quick overview of Scythe. Like I said, you can add a bunch of stuff in here. Even though we were talking about YouTube today, I just want to show you Facebook real quick because I know that's something that everybody wants to monitor what's coming on with their Facebook page. So I'm going to add my Facebook in here and just get an overview. Okay, because, you know, Facebook and YouTube... Those are the two things that you definitely like to see together in one place. And then you don't have to go back and forth over into insights. This just gives you an idea. Luckily, I picked a good time. And as I mentioned earlier, I've been doing a little promotions over on Facebook. That's why everything is in the green going up. <laughs> okay, guys. Well, thanks for joining me today. And once again, make sure you get a copy of the YouTube Rankings Assault Kit because I want to see you succeed on YouTube. Peace.